lady's regular harness. See how she automatically sits before she's harnessed? Because we've been doing this a while. She is not wiggly at all. And this is the ultimate goal to harnessing your dog. Here's where the head goes through. So your best bet is to treat them as you put their head in. Now, a lot of dogs do not like that, anything going over their head. If that's the case, you wanna treat them every time the harness goes over their head. And you could do this with one hand too. I like to put the treat right here and feed while I'm putting that on. The next part of this is the leg. You will pick up the leg from underneath the dog, put the leg in the harness, and treat right after. Then go under your dog and not over. Attach the harness on and then treat again. take the harness off, you're going to need more treats as the dog begins to get conditioned to the harness. I'm going to treat her when I unclip it. I'm going to treat her when I put her arm through. And one more treat when I'm putting it over her head. another version of this with another type of harness. The presence of the harness to her means to sit and that makes my job a lot easier. Um, it also means that she likes getting her harness put on and it's a good thing for her um, um, because she is awaiting it and anticipating it. She's doing a very good job. She's a good dog. attach harness which I don't use very often and the, nothing starts until she's sitting if your dog continues to jump up at a harness or a leash you're just going to keep asking them to sit and treating them every time they stay seated with the presence of the harness you can do it over and over and over again I'm actually fake treating her right now because I have nothing in my hands I'm gonna get some more. You will hold up the harness. You're just going to treat her just like this. Or him. So this harness works a little differently. This only has one strap to put on. And this is the part that goes over the dog's head. And I put my hand right here. I put the treat in right here, and I treat as I'm putting it over her head. Again, if your dog has a hard time with things going over their head, you're going to put it on, treat, take it off, treat, put it on, treat. You're going to go underneath the dog to get the strap. And then after the clip, you're going to treat again. Yeah.